Hello, welcome to Bill's World, the game in the kitchen. It's Easter time and we've got a very, very busy weekend, we've got the hotels full. And I'm just in the process of making a salmon and crab meat roulade, which I spoke about earlier on. Very, very simple. Uh, it's, a, it's a little starter dish that we actually saw when we were down in, uh, on the Costa del Sol. Mediterranean and it was uh, a beautiful beautiful starter. All you need is long sliced smoked salmon although deep cuts will do quite well but long sliced is easier. Crab meat and a little bit of creamed horseradish not the chunky stuff nice and creamy and in terms of quantities putting the horseradish into the crab it all depends on how much you like horseradish, uh, as much or as little as you like. So they're the simple ingredients that you need. What we do, we put a piece of cling film down, lay the long slices of smoked salmon on it, and then put the crab meat at one end, spreading it across the salmon. I don't know whether you can see this or not, but it's pretty straightforward. The method of doing this is, is a bit like you do a Swiss roll on greaseproof paper. Because what you're going to do now is roll it up to create the roulade. So we just bring the end of the cling film over, roll it a little bit, and then just, just firm it up a bit, make it tight, and then you lift one end of the cling, cling film and just literally roll it forward just like that till you get to the other end. You have to separate the cling film off the roll, bring it back over and roll it up. So there we have our salmon and crab meat roulade. Very very simple. Now all you need to do with this now is put it in the fridge and let it chill down nicely and when you're ready you cut it into small slices for the roulade. I put it on a little brown a little brown plate, three slices per portion, some cherry tomatoes and some fresh salad leaves in the middle with a balsamic and a honey dressing drizzled over the top of it. Beautiful starter, very easily uh, for you to make, great for a dinner party at home. If people like smoked salmon and crab meat, they're really going to uh, enjoy this particular one because it's extremely tasty. And uh, the beauty of it is you can make it at least a day or two before and then put it in the fridge. Um, I would always recommend making it a day before because it's a lot easier to slice when you're ready to service. Service time will only take you a couple of minutes to put it together. Uh, when you're ready to serve. If you get left over with some or you make too much it also will freeze extremely well. Pop it in your freezer hole in the cling film. Uh, when you're ready to use it you need to take it out of the freezer for about 12 hours, slice it as normal and it's absolutely perfect. So that's the smoked salmon and crab roulade. Um, wonderful, easy, Impress your friends. See you next time. Bye.